today is going to be somewhat of a jam-packed day because I am preparing for a Canva training that I have coming up and I decided that hey I'm gonna be working from a cafe today I might do a little cafe up in but all in all I have to be working on this camera training and I want to do it in a different space that makes me feel inspired and uh, yeah so let's watch it let's go training in two days like so we am gonna take some natural over remedies and see how best I can get over this stuffiness and whatever I am super tired um coming now with the flu so that's a challenge in of itself that I have to work through but I'm gonna go now and get some stuff to see if I can feel better before this training. So today is the Canva training day with my client. I am excited but nervous. I'm nervous this is because this is my first in-person training and i think just nervous overall i think i struggle with performance anxiety it's something i've struggled with since my teenage years especially when i have exams and you know even last night coming into this morning just remind me that this is something that i struggle with but um i keep reminding myself that like i keep saying to myself clearly like you know this this is your thing you're not teaching them anything that you don't know you're not telling them anything that you don't know so just be confident um please myself because anytime i get nervous i tend to just want to rush through things so <clears throat> my mouth get dry and stuff like that but yes i am ready i would say my presentation is ready i did some test runs last night make a few um edits here and there <sighs> yeah so yeah and i was nervous too because um a big part of everything for me especially like an in-person event is like my outfit and it's like okay i'm not so sure what i'm going to wear i know i wanted to wear the brand colors for the company and i was like yeah i don't really like how those clothes fit and then no i was like you know what let me wear the brand colors for my brand so i am very very purpled out right now <laughs> but yeah all in all it will be a good day you know and i'm excited so i'll share some clips here and there and yeah all right so i am here 
and I'm just waiting to go inside. Yeah, so I'm gonna go in now, set up, make sure everything, curry gravy, I'm ready to go. Okay, so I just finished my training with the Jamaica Olympic Association and it went great. Have to, yeah, it went good. So you'll see the highlights of everything, how it went. Really proud of myself and I've another that's actually coming up. So stay posted for that. Okay, so I literally just left Starbucks and well, like, you know, I was just in there and because I bought myself like a treat after the training. I was like, you know what? I leave this training and buy a treat. And I was like, I decided to buy myself a treat now because I'm feeling dumb or because I'm feeling really happy, right? I tend to be an emotional eater. And in this case, because I'm really happy and proud of myself, I was like, you know, I'm going to give myself a treat. But there's a bigger thing to all of this. And the bigger thing is that I am really proud of myself. Um, for those who know, I've been using Canva for years, for years. I decided to start sharing my knowledge on Canva in 2020. And that was just a sporadic thing, like very impulsive. I just decided, you know what, I want to share my knowledge in Can on Canva. And then I haven't been very consistent, but I share my knowledge and people start calling me the canva girl i even call myself the canva boss that kind of thing and uh, recently someone referred me for a training for canva no my client is not on is not following me on my social media account they didn't know about me before but i've been working on building my online presence and just growing and when the person reached out to me, I was like, hey, you know, someone reached out to me, they want to come a training, here's what I bought about. It was the first time doing a Canva training for a team. No, I'm saying all of this to say that it was something that I prayed for. I wanted to start doing Canva training. I wanted to start doing more one-on-ones. I wanted to start getting paid for what I'm doing. But the big picture outside of all of the desires and the wants was that I had to start and even though going on camera being on camera was something that took me outside of my comfort zone I knew it was something that I had to do in order to unlock a new level no today unlocked a new level for me as well because even though I know Canva and everything that I'm teaching is not foreign to me training in Canva in person was new and I had just a fear, uh, not fear, I would say it was fear, but just nervousness overall. And I did it, right? I did it and I'm so proud of myself. And I love the feeling, it's like, you know, I want more of this. I want more of this. I want more of this on myself. I want to be doing more of this. I want to be traveling and doing this. And I want to be talking about things that I love. I want to be sharing my knowledge about things I'm really good at. And I want to get paid for it so this is like a personal video to myself but also a video to to you if you're watching it which is nothing is off limits 
for you um there's nothing off limits for you um and it can happen it might not happen right now next year but it can happen and it will happen um and you just have to keep putting in the work and sometimes it will get daunting sometimes you'll feel like you're wasting your time like who will ever see this how will i ever get anywhere but it all all it takes is just one yes one yes and to find that one thing that gave you that success and to keep repeating it so whatever i was doing to get this or achieve this particular moment i'm gonna keep doing it so yeah i'm really proud of myself to be honest really really proud of myself and i'm so grateful for this opportunity yeah really happy grateful so grateful so grateful so grateful so today is day two and the final day for the camera training. Today I'm being so chauffeur driven um, by my friend who is also my co-assistant, right? So I, as, you, as you can hear, my voice is very hoarse, but the show must go on, right? So I'm going to push through and today you'll see some behind the scenes of how that goes. The images are not always the best because when you say Jamaica, you might get a green, yet, but the green might not be the green that matches for our flag. You might get an image which not might be a sport, but you might get something depicting Jamaica, which might be a can selfish <laughs> or some other stuff in the jersey. Right, so that is way off. Right, I'm going to use another prompt. And I want to show you how you can use your own image and even your branding to bring it to life. Wrapped up the session in two days. Did one last week. This is the final day. <laughs> it was really good. It was good. I enjoyed it. Yeah, and the feedback was good. You can see the excitement on my face, right? Yeah.